Merry Christmas, Misfit Nation. Welcome to another Misfit Minute. If you don't want to go watch the movie Beckett that's, I think, on Prime or one of the Hulus or something, you can just listen to this real quick. St. Thomas Beckett was the drinking buddy of King Henry II back in, like, 1150 or some garbage like that. So what happened was the king wanted, needed a new Archbishop of Canterbury. And St. Thomas Beckett, even though he was advanced in his theological studies, he never was ordained a priest. So eventually the king was like, hey, you're my buddy. You'll go along with whatever I say, so I'm going to make you the Archbishop of Canterbury. And the dude's like... Right on. Then after his ordination, all of a sudden he kind of started to change and he started to do things according to the way of God and not the way of, you know, the world as he previously did. And eventually some one of the king's other buddies did some jacked up stuff. I think he killed the dude and he had to be excommunicated. And the Archbishop of Canterbury, his, his, the king's old drinking buddy, St. Thomas More, no, Beckett, St. Thomas Beckett, uh, excommunicated the guy, excommunicated the guy and... Subsequently, he was martyred and died a martyr for the church because he wanted to do things the way of God. In this day and age, we need bishops and priests and popes and religious and even just, you know, to, to live up to this same type of example to say, I was ordained a priest. I was ordained a bishop. I took an vow before the Lord. I need to be upholding the things of God and not the things of the world. And we need to pray for the, the intercession of uh, St. Thomas Beckett. Unfortunately, the way things are going now, it seems like we're more along the lines of uh, that's going to bring us out of the, this darkness of the church is going to be great saints like St. Thomas More, who I briefly accidentally mentioned, who basically all the bishops, all the Catholic bishops went, okay, we're going to go with the Church of England and screw you, Rome. And St. Thomas More was like, no, I'm a lay person. I'm one of the normal everyday Catholics, but I can't do this. Look, King, I serve you, but I serve God first. Anyway, so... I guess pray for these great St. Thomases, both from England. All right, thank you for watching. Bye.